Hi Virgo, Aditi here with Lodestone Productions where we help you discover your true north. So welcome to your reading for the month of March. Bear in mind that this is a general reading, so not everything is going to resonate with everyone also. Spirit is not bound to our time and space continuum, so the only time by which we tell time is divine time. You dig know what I'm saying? All right, so we'll have the overall message here for the clarifying information here, and then I will pick a random deck and shuffle to get either final messages and or advice from spirit. Also, I do not read reversals, so if you see me turning cards over, this is why, this is why, this is why. All right, let's get this party started. Mm. Your hard work is paying off. Virgo is no stranger to hard work. Oh, look at that. We got the Fool card. We've got the Knight of Pentacles. Then we've got the Tower, the Knight of Cups, the Seven of Cups, Five of Cups. Yeah. Hanged Man, the Sun, the Magician. Wow, lots of majors. Good gravy. Justice, Knight of Wands, and the Six of Cups. Yes, your hard work is paying off. You, okay, so we've got this whole, this whole cluster of Major Arcana here there's my word okay you're starting something new and this is going to be this this journey that you're about to embark on is going to be a long one but with that that also means that all of this stuff that has been holding you back is being washed away all those things that no longer serve you is being removed. Now, sometimes in a violent fashion, um, it it can it, it's not it's not comfortable. There there's nothing there's nothing comfortable about what's being depicted in this card. Okay, it's a tower. It's a big shakeup. But with that big shakeup, you have a renewed sense of emotion it's not necessarily love you know what I mean but it's a it's a renewed sense of yes a renewed sense of emotion right it's like the okay that part's done now we're free to now we're free to look at these options seven of cups it's no sense in crying over spilled milk here with the five of cups. Like there's a lot of loss here and it's good to honor what has been removed because it was good for the time that it was good, right? Like that, it served its purpose. And because of that, and now that you have this new space and these new options, you can look at things in a completely different way with the hanged man here. Your, you can really flip things upside down. You can, you can, you know, flip it and reverse it. it you're a fuman, but you, you can do that now, right? With the hanged man, because when that happens, you have, the sun here, it's going to illuminate the fact that you have everything that you need at your disposal to be able to make not only just effective change, but effective targeted change that's going to spark new passion with you and also bring you happiness that's going to carry you for generations on out. Okay, first of all, that is the quickest synopsis I had ever done. That's at four minutes and 44 seconds. Holy cannoli. That was, all right, Virgo, quick and dirty, huh? 
just just waste waste no time whatsoever okay so let's look at the six of cups here and let's look at what it is that you're working to what it what is what is Virgo working towards are you serious the fool in the tower again. So, seriously, the fool and the tower again. The fool and the fool. Same card, two decks. serious about this newness, this new cycle that's coming through here. All right. All right. They, they, are, they are dead serious with you about this, Virgo. Like, either that or you are. This soup tastes like horse piss. Give me something better. Uh, well, okay. Got the star, which is healing. Five of Pentacles, which is feeling left out in the cold. This is also recognizing the loss. Not to be confused with the Five of Cups. See, the Five of Pentacles is talking about like a loss in resources. The Five of the Five of Cups, however, is about crying over spilt milk. It's it's more working in the heart space as opposed to what is physically available to you, right? And then you've got the Empress. And the Empress it does knows the Empress understands the lack of mentality, yet she chooses not to operate in that because she knows that she is creation, that she is abundance. Now there is there's also the Ace of Wands here, which is about a new passionate beginning. Can we the full card? Yes, a new passionate beginning. Because stepping away from what didn't work, going through the pain of the loss and healing from that pain of the loss and knowing and understanding that with this cleared away frees you to be, thank you spirit, frees you to be able, frees you up to be able to create, which is igniting a new sense of passion in you. the healing so that you can recognize and embody your creative nature. Sure. Recognize and embody your creative nature. pick up a third deck, but oh, a fourth deck. Alright. Let's see what we have. Let's see what we got here for you, Virgo. Is there 
Are there any other messages that, uh, apparently so, are there any other messages that you want to give to Virgo from March 2021? Any other messages for Virgo from March? page of wands with the page of wands there is a message of remaining fluid with your passion understand that there is more where this came from there is more where this came from and recognizing the newness of it and as well as it's it's fleeting nature because when we're talking about wands and we're talking about we're talking about fire energy and while it is highly combustible and it's depending on its kindling will determine how long lasting the effects are. So you, with this page of wands energy, with the proper kindling or the nurturing of this particular energy, it can either turn into a wildfire, which could be highly destructive, or it could turn into a fire that warms the house. It could be fireworks, which are brilliant, but must be observed from a distance. Number one, to fully take in its magnificence and also for your safety. So this fire energy, it is, even though it is new, it's still young but there's there are so many different forms that it can take and with the page of wands the page of wands is aware of that it's it's aware of the mutability of the element so be open to receiving your gifts in a manner that you may not expect but know but know that your hard work is indeed paying off and that you are up for new things. All right, Virgo. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. Until we meet again, remember to be good to yourselves and to each other, and I will see you next time. Bye, Virgo.